Today we meet a teacher who is getting students ready for college and careers. Brad Means joins us now. I'm helping her students master math and computer science and Amy Lewis is part of a great team at Grovetown High School. Miss Lewis is also the winner of the Golden Apple Award. Amy Lewis has a deep passion for teaching math, but there was a time when she wasn't sure she'd pursue that passion. My first love was theater and English, and I actually thought about going that direction, but I was good at math. And once I actually got into it, I found out that it is beautiful in a way that we don't see very often or that we don't think about. Now she shares that beauty with her students at Grovetown High School. And to me, math is like this never-ending book you can read that just goes further and further, and it's just absolutely beautiful when you understand what it really is. She's also helping to shape the future leaders in an industry that's getting bigger and more important every day. I teach AP Computer Science, which is a college board course, and we learn how to code in Java. So we do develop programs. I have students right now that are working towards degrees in computer science, IT, uh, cybersecurity. Amy Lewis is proud of her students and impressed by how they've held up. This has been a tough year for kids, and you can see the anxiety that they have over just the uncertainty of their future and what things are going to be like. But my gosh, these kids are resilient. Grovetown students are the most resilient students that we have, I think. Mrs. Lewis is impacting so many lives. She's dedicated to her family at home and her extended family here at Grovetown High. The more that you do for other people, the more that you feel like doing for other people. You see the benefits of it. And, uh, you know, my kids are my priority, but I just happen to have 152 kids. Congratulations, Mrs. Lewis. And by the way, if you have a teacher in your life who deserves the Golden Apple Award, we would like to know about them. Just go to our website, wjbf.com, and fill out a nomination form.